Women's History Month is celebrated in March. During this month, we recognize and honor women who have accomplished important work involving women's rights and equality. Women's History Month is rooted in International Women's Day. The first International Women's Day was on March 8, 1911. In 1978, a school district in Northern California recognized and celebrated International Women's Day for an entire week. This trend caught on and soon more and more schools were extending the day to a week, sometimes two weeks. In February 1980, President Jimmy Carter issued a presidential proclamation declaring the week of March 8, 1980, a Women's History Week. He stated, From the first settlers who came to our shores, from the first American Indian families who befriended them, men and women have worked together to build this nation. Too often the women were unsung and sometimes their contributions went unnoticed. But the achievements, leadership, courage, strength, and love of the women who built America was as vital as that of the men whose names we know so well. The women celebrated during Women's History Month are women who accomplished much. We honor women like Marie Curie, who was a physicist and chemist. We honor women like Susan B. Anthony, who worked during the women's suffrage movement that allowed women to vote. And also women like Martha Griffiths, who was one of the first women to win a seat in Congress. Good morning, Centennial High School. Yes, I know, I know. And you guys are like, what the heck is going on with Miss Love? First she's here, then she's not, then she's here, then she's not, then she's not, not here, here, not, not. <sighs> yes, I apologize for that. <laughs> Sometimes, in order for me to keep up the bubbly, positive energy that you guys all like during my announcements, sometimes I need a break. Miss Love is starting to get drained. <laughs> and sometimes I need a break, so I'm thinking about making the video announcements every other Monday. You will still have announcements every Monday, but the video will be every other Monday because... Sometimes I, I I don't feel like <laughs> putting on the bubbly personality and I never want to get on camera and you guys go, What the heck is going on with Miss Love? Clearly she's in a mood. I don't want that ever to happen. So, yeah. So the video announcements will be every other Monday now. But you'll still get announcements every Monday. But the video announcements every other Monday. Okay, so that's my personal announcement. Now on to your... School announcements. Let's go. The deadline to apply to Cal is today, March 1st, and you can apply at this link right here. And Wednesday, March 3rd, Cal will be having in-person tours for students and families, but you must sign up for a time slot. Students and families are expected to wear a mask covering both the nose and mouth and practice social distancing. Cal asks you to share the program that you are most interested in during registration and it will be included in your tour. Seniors, all seniors, this includes Cal students, you will be having a senior meeting in your advisory classes this Thursday, March Fourth, You will be discussing graduation on June 10th and there will be additional opportunities to order caps and gowns at this meeting. Young Woman of Purpose is a REAP event that focuses on building community, confidence, and self-love for female youth in the PDX area. This year's theme is a sea of change. Find your constant, shape your story, embodying the idea that change is normal and every day is an opportunity to start fresh. Join us for a virtual vision board party using Canva, Friday, March 5th from 11 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. Please let your teachers know that you will be participating in this event beforehand so that they know and we can get things settled. Okay? Okay. Just a reminder that Season 2 
sports clearing is now happening for volleyball, cross country, soccer, and football. Please visit the athletics page for more information. Hey gamers, yes you! We're officially putting together a small eSports tournament. By popular choice, it will include Rocket League, League 3v3, 3 versus 3, I don't know, Tetris, Minecraft, PvP, and Super, oh, Super Smash Brothers? What y'all know about that? Registration is now open, and you may sign up with a team or as a free agent. Sign up using this form. Hey, freshmen, do you guys like free stuff? Well, each of you will be getting a free class of 2024 t-shirt. Can I get one of those? Cause I'm trying to, I'm trying to build up my gear, you know, my centennial, my centennial swag, you know, and uh, I need a class of 2024. I actually, I need all the classes. So if y'all ahead, uh, in charge of that, I, I need everything. If you got like, sports or any kind of club you want me to represent you know cindy here <laughs> anyway freshman please fill out this survey so we can determine your size these have been your morning announcements with miss love and i will see you when i see you when i see you you have a lovely weekend until next time <sighs> yeah